Hey guys, it's Katie, and I'm just gonna be doing a little weekend vlog for y'all. It's currently Saturday night at Saturday, November 9th at 9.40 at night. I had a really long day today though. It was super fun and super action-packed, but I'm literally exhausted. But I wanted to tell y'all about it. I'm sorry, just have like shoes around me right now. <laughs> today, I went to see Wicked Off-Broadway, which was really cool. My mom and I, and pretty much the entire cheer team went to go see wicked like the musical at the fox theater in downtown atlanta and then we went out to eat and it was super super fun it was all moms and daughters it was just a really really good time i had a lot of fun with avery unfortunately jamie couldn't go and a bunch of my other cheer friends that are on my team so that was just awesome it was a great experience the play was literally so good all the actors and performers were amazing then we went out to dinner we took pictures i posted some on instagram and they turned out really cute so definitely go look at those if you want look at that though like that's so cute right my caption was oh my lanta and if you don't get the reference it's from full house but i wanted to start this little like late weekend vlog for tonight and tomorrow and the reason that i wanted to start it right now is because i'm gonna go fake tan and take a shower it's winter and i'm so pale right now my palest is at its prime during winter and i just feel ugly when i'm pale i haven't put fake tan on in like three weeks and all my friends keep fake tanning and looking bronzed and beautiful during winter and i'm pale so I was like, I'm gonna start this vlog because whenever I fake tan, I always look orange the immediate next day because I'm not patient and I don't wait for it to develop properly. So I figured this would be funny. <laughs> That's literally the main reason why I decided to start this vlog now. So you could see the before, before I tan and the after when I'm orange and like have spots all over my face. Also posted a main channel video today of my school morning routine. So go watch that if you didn't because that's a that little updated version. I'm gonna go hop in the shower right now and then come back to you guys right before I fake tan. So this is a fake tanner that I use it's called Isle of Paradise. I'll link it down below for you guys. I bought mine off Amazon. Mine came. I bought the pack for the face fake tanner and the body one. I've talked about this before though. Mine's in the shade medium and it's a self tanning water. So you literally spray this on your body and rub it in with the mitt and then it develops overnight and you wake up with a super pretty tan. And then for the face one, you just put these drops into your moisturizer and put them on your face and it's all good. So it's super easy. Makes you super tan. Here's a little before of my color. It's nighttime. I'm just using my bathroom lights. I got them fixed by the way, finally. They were broken for the longest and i'll see you guys tomorrow morning and you will see what i look like hi guys so then it was sunday morning and i just got back from church and i proceeded to try out these really cool new fake magnetic eyelashes and i don't know about you but i have super blonde eyelashes and i wanted to try these out but my microphone didn't record so i couldn't give you guys any audio which is why i'm doing this really ratchet voiceover how you use these fake magnetic eyelashes is it comes with a magnetic eyeliner and you line your eye with it and then literally the lashes just stick like automatically really really easy and it was so cool and really fast and easy so i tried them out and i really ended up liking them and i decided i was gonna do like a little review or test for this video and go throughout them with my whole day and now i feel like a little baddie because i've been wearing them forever and they look really pretty so i'll link them down below if you want to shop them they were kind of expensive but you get to wear them like 30 times and there's a bunch of different styles i'm not sponsored i just really wanted to try these out and i showed my mom and she liked them so that's what i rambled on for this long about i'm sorry you had to hear this voiceover goodbye i don't think I had the mic on for that last clip and I literally just filmed for 15 minutes I was talking about these magnetic eyelashes that I bought from kiss and I wanted to test them out in this video But I literally think I forgot to turn the mic on Meaning that y'all didn't hear me the whole time. So hopefully I was a voiceovering that I'm trying out these magnetic eyelashes from kiss for the day just to see if I like them I'm Currently on Instagram live so y'all can all say hi to the vlog and This will be on my vlog channel This one in the inner corner is the only thing that's giving me trouble. This eye looks super good. It looks really nice This is the one that is not working. That is what the lashes look like. I like them so far We're gonna test them out for the day and Hopefully they work. <laughs> there is like no place in my mom's car to be able to set up my camera. It's so like it's in a wobbly little area right now. But my mom and I are headed out to go to the mall now. Pink is doing their 10 for 35 sale on undies and I really need some new ones. So that's what we're gonna go do. You know dad's coming with, right? He's coming to the mall? Yes. So Why? You're gonna have to get in the back. He wants to watch me buy underwear? No. <laughs> you're in the back. Oh, is he actually gonna go in the back? I guess so. Can I drive? No. Yay. Ten for thirty-five. Oh, it's Christmassy. Mm, it smells so good. <laughs> this is my favorite perfume. 
Oh, I, this is like the updated packaging. I'm almost out of mine. Mom, Christmas present? Put I'm it on your list. Out. Put it on your list. Fresh and clean perfume. It's my favorite. And I'm, I I've had I the like same one for two oh, years. Oh, I do like this one best. Okay, this is what I'm here for. Now it's time to choose. I found a tin right here, and they're all super cute. There's a few Christmas ones. And then my mother is looking for her own tin for 35 <laughs> So cute, it's so fun. LOL, when I just recorded my whole Victoria's Secret haul and it didn't record because my mic wasn't on. This mic is gonna be the death of me. Like, it's absolutely crazy. I got back from the mall and I met three subscribers while I was there. So thank you to those three girls for coming up to me. They were very sweet and we took a picture. So that was fun. I'm going to do a little haul and I feel like some people are gonna think this is like controversial to show your underwear on the internet, but I'm a teen girl and pretty much if you're a girl just in general, you wear bras and underwear. And I think we should be showing this and not be scared to talk about it. But if you're a weird, creepy dude, please don't watch this video. Go watch something else because I'm just a girl who's trying to spread girl positivity and I don't need you watching my video. If you're weird and creepy, hop off this. But if you are a teenage girl and you want to see what I bought from Victoria's Secret, we're going to do a haul. Like I said, 10 for 35 Normally, each pair of underwear from pink is $10.80, making each pair come out to $3.50. That's awesome. And I'm very excited. I got some very cute thongs and cheekies, which are my favorite pairs. And then I did end up getting two bras that are like their seamless bras. They're the only ones that I wear because I hate regular bras. I only wear sports bras. Okay, this is going in no specific order, but we're just gonna start with thongs. First one that I got is this super cute like kind of royal navy blue and then it has the Victoria's Secret dog and a heart. Then I got this Christmas one, which is just this green and it has like mistletoes and the pink dog and it says pink all over it. I really love pink waistband underwear. Those are personally my favorite just because I think they're the most comfy and they're super cute. You'll notice a lot of that, but this is just this mint like teal green one and has the super shiny it has the super shiny waistband that says pink and then it says pink all over it but these are adorable next i got this another cotton one and this is just like a mauvey purple pink color and it says victoria's secret pink on the little logo right here i'm so excited about these i chose these cherry black thong and this one is adorable personally i love like the black on black waistband i think that's so so cute i love the print of these and again the waistband is just super comfy so i'm excited about wearing those then I got another seamless thong and these are neon pink and these are just so fun like I love this color in anything seamless I do wear a small in pink underwear but in anything that's like normal with waistbands I do wear a medium when they're seamless there's no seams obviously and so they'll fall down if you get like your normal size so I would recommend go a size smaller medium is my true to size and seamless I'm a small but these are really soft and then I just got four cheeky or like cheekster I think that's what they're called I would prefer these over thongs but you know what you gotta have a mixture of both I don't want underwear lines when I'm wearing leggings. This is probably one of my favorite pairs that I got and it's just this royal blue. And on the back it says pink in these big letters. I think these are the cutest and again, these are my favorite. They're the most comfortable with the waistband and I just love this color. This is by far one of my favorite colors. Again, I got the Cheekster and this is a navy blue. It looks black on camera but it has the sparkly waistband and then it says pink repeating all over. This is pink on pink but these are like their Christmas undies and it has the little dog logo but he's wearing Santa hat and it's so cute. So I did feel a little festive getting some Christmas ones. You know, you gotta hop on the bandwagon. And then the last pair that I got are these seamless cheeky and it has the little like three straps to hold them together. So that is my Victoria's Secret underwear haul. Again, if you're weird, please, please don't comment about it. I don't wanna hear you comment about my underwear. That's just, no. But I'm a teenage girl and I think we should be talking about these things because everyone wears underwear. Like I don't get why, why it's like a big thing to share on the internet. By the way, I asked my mom if I can do this haul and she said, it's fine so I have my parental permission then I did get two bras like I said I am a 36 D or 36 double D and I know I have a lot in my upper area I was blessed up here it's a blessing and a curse because my back hurts a lot because I'm a heavy up here I don't wear regular bras I only wear sports bras I own two regular bras and I probably wear them once a month I hate bras they're the worst thing in the whole wide world I only buy bras that don't have underwire and that are seamless or sports bras pink makes my absolute favorite bras and these are called their wireless lightly lined. There's absolutely no padding in here because I don't need it, but they're so comfy and so cute and they give me support. The first wireless seamless bra that I got is this navy blue one and it
it just has the pink logo and repeating again it does have a clasp which gives you support but it doesn't push up because I don't need that it's super super comfy and these are by far my favorite bras these were on sale for $15 normally they're 30 and then I just bought this black one exact same bra so these are my favorite I highly recommend you check these out if you don't want any push-up or padding they're the best that's all that I got from pink I'm so excited about everything I don't know about y'all but whenever I get like new undergarments I just feel like a baddie <laughs> definitely go hop on the 10 for 35 deal I think it's ending soon but I definitely recommend you shop there when they're on sale because I did end up getting a lot a lot of stuff from pink but I'm gonna go upstairs and eat my grilled cheese because I haven't eaten anything and it's already two o'clock in the afternoon that's my little girly things haul um please 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 again if you're weird don't comment about my underwear I don't know what else this vlog has in store for us I'm gonna go upstairs and we'll see what else happens it's been a pretty chill but eventful day and I'm glad I got out of the house and got to go shopping so it is now later in the night and I haven't really updated you guys but I am on TikTok live so definitely go follow me on TikTok because I go live on here a lot so thank you to everyone who's watching right now you're all gonna be in the vlog 9 30 at night and I've had a very long and productive day I spent the whole day cleaning out my room taking out trash decluttering hanging up clothes doing laundry and my room looks really really good compared to how it was today obviously you saw shopping and everything I watched videos I edited this video I just had a pretty productive day which I needed I have a busy busy week coming up this week so I thought I would just post this vlog tomorrow on Monday it will be Monday November 11th so give it a big thumbs up and subscribe follow all my socials hopefully enjoy seeing my little weekend life I love you guys thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one peace in the Middle East